All right, continuing coverage of CES 2023. Jeffrey Powers with Key Cuisine. I'm here with Guy. I'm here with Keenan. And uh, we've got Dr. A deal. Make a deal. Uh, make a deal. Akhtar. Yeah. Sorry. And then Dan St. Pierre. That was, that was easier. And this guy right here, got to hand it to him. They're doing a great job here at CES because they caught our attention really easy, really quick. So what what is this called? So our company is Psionic, and this is our bionic ability hand um, that's out on the market. It's a FDA-registered bionic hand for people who are missing their hands, and it's covered by Medicare here in the U.S. That's awesome. So I can get, if I lose my hand, I could get something like this. Exactly. And, oh, wow, that's awesome. So you're wearing it. Uh, how, does it how does it feel? Uh, it feels really good. I mean, it's, super, it's a lot lighter than any other hand that I've uh, worn in the past. Okay. Uh, a lot quicker, more durable. Durable. <laughs> dur durable or durable? Durable. It's, durable. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's adorable it's like, and it's durable. Yeah. No, so. um, yeah. And I mean, we literally, we break boards. I wear this thing to work out. I beat it up and it keeps going. Oh, really? How much is, how much can you, how much pressure do you get on that? Well, so you can lift about 50 pounds. You, uh, yeah. Like you can do a 50 pound kettlebell swing with it. I okay. think we've maxed it out at 78 pounds, uh, but it's still delicate enough to hold a raspberry without crushing it. Nice. So. nice. <laughs> is, it, is it hard to control the pressure on there? No, not at all. We don't have a raspberry. The guy's trying to... to, to <laughs> <laughs> what are you, you're trying to take off the cap? Maybe. I don't know. If it, how, would I be able to apply enough pressure with that? So you might be able to do it if you use a different grip, like with the thumb, and then like um, kind of like grip it in there and then wrench it around. So it, it's a different, it's, you'd have to switch which um, grip you're on. Yeah, I might be able to try it. Okay, you want to try it? Okay. You want to do it in a key? Try it in a key grip. Do it in the key so of how do, you, how do you change oh. <laughs> your grip? Or how do you change so, your profile? So um, what Dan is doing is that when the hand is open, if he opens it again, then um, he can um, switch grips that way. Excellent. So, is it able to? Maybe. Uh, no, it's just spinning in there. Sure. Uh, well, it, that's something to work on no, for the future. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, so, he can hold it with his. He can hold the bottle with that hand and then open it with um, his right hand. So that's okay. that's one thing that he's able to. Do. What generation is this? So this is actually the ninth generation of the okay. hand over the last seven years. And um, and actually, if you want to try controlling it yourself, um, we can do that too. So um, if you put your left hand in the camera here, so, so go ahead and let's track your hand on there. Check okay. my left hand in. Now make a fist. Is actually oh, that's going awesome. To follow your finger movements. I, I won't do the obvious one, but I will. That is, that is, that is pretty sweet. Absolutely. So, so uh, how you said it took seven years and nine, nine versions to develop this part. Are there any other limbs that you're working on? Yeah. So we've got plans to uh, make an ability leg in addition to our ability hand that can do a triathlon. So uh, you, you'll see that in the next five years coming out. If I lose my hand, I'm a drummer, so if I lose my hand, will I be able to play drums again? Actually, we've got a, a drummer who just got our hand uh, a month ago, so we're going to find out. Who is it? Um, Jason Barnes. Um, Jason Barnes? Yes. Okay. Um, he lives out in um, Atlanta, Georgia. So, okay. yeah. I know there there are a few one-handed drummers that are on TikTok and, and, and Twitch and stuff like he, that. So I think he is one of them. So, okay. yeah. I'll have to check out his channel. And, yeah. And go from there. Any other high-end influencers uh, that are using the arm um, so, besides besides Dan here yeah so um, we have um, army sergeants who have um, uh, who uh, lost his hand so Sergeant Garrett Anderson who lost his hand in Iraq in 2005 and um, what, where he's done push-ups on it for the first time since his army days um, we've got uh, several like cosplayers um, who have been using our hand as well and um, actresses as well so um, yeah you, you were talking about the army do you guys make even stronger arms you know I don't want to say lift tanks or anything like that, but something that'll do a little bit more than than this arm could handle. Um, so actually, I mean, this is this is the same one that you want to see uh, him break a board. We can actually give, have him do a board breaking demonstration. Yeah. All right. Uh, oh, we're gonna do a little karate chop in action. You re you ready to karate chop on this thing? Uh, yeah. No, I'm gonna let Dan do it. Okay. Okay. Oh, you want to hold it? All right. All right. All right. All right. Sure Guy's gonna hold it. Do it again, do it again. <laughs> this is what I was talking about earlier. I mean, it still works. Other hands would have just shattered. Okay. It would have broke. Now you did the you did the fist. Can you do like the chop or is 
We haven't tried it, but no, don't do it. To, don't do it today. <laughs> but, uh, we'll work out now so they come back next year with it. There you go. There you go. <laughs> so the name of the company is um, Psionic. Psionic. Yes. He- P-S-Y-O-N-I-C. Okay. If I just wanted to get one to play with and I didn't have Medicare, uh, how much would something like that cost? Yeah, so it can be around like 15K. Okay. Um, and then Medicare will, will usually pay around 30K for a hand okay. like ours. So, yeah. All right. Well, you know, let me get out my checkbook. That's, uh, that's all <laughs> well, good. So. We are we are in the middle of an equity crowdfunding round. So if you want to invest in the company, you can go to our website and check it out. Okay. And you said you're, you're working on other parts like legs and, yep. and things like that. Absolutely. So. And we're going to have a full bionic person. Steve Austin's going to be really here. That is the goal. Okay. Where do people go for more information? Um, so our website's psionic.io. Psionic.io. Yes. Okay. There you go. Well, thank you guys very much for your time. Thanks for breaking Absolutely. the board on there. And you can shake my real hand. Can, can, <laughs> I, can I shake the fake hand too? There we go. There we go. Thank you very much. <laughs> there you go. All right. That's that's all the cool stuff that we have. Well, a lot more cool stuff at CES 2023. Jeffrey Powers here. The Geek is in with Keenan, with Guy, uh, with Dan, and uh, a, deal. a deal. He's making a deal for you, for your hand. Got to hand it to that. So anyway, it's the real deal. So <laughs> Jeffrey Powers of Geekazine, got a lot more actions. Go ahead, check it out on YouTube. Like, subscribe, comment, bell notifications so you know when the next video comes out. Till next time, you guys geek out. Can you do that? Geek out? That's It's sign language G and O. Here, let's try with the app. All right, so hand up. Oh, it's using my... Okay, hand up, so I go geek. Geek out. Wow. I've done it robotically. That's awesome. That's awesome. Thanks a lot, guys. Thank you.